Thank you for tuning in today to Cedarville's special programming, The Decision. We're here with Brian Reddick. Brian, you have a very important decision to make. Just explain what this process has been like for you. Well, it's, um, it's been a very hard process. You know, on the one hand, I've been very happy with where I've been since I've been here at Cedarville. You know, the people love me and I, and I appreciate that. But on the other hand, you know, I have to do what's right for me in the long run. What factors have gone into your decision-making process? Consider things such as, you know, atmosphere, staff, choices, and, and mainly hours of operation. You know, as a basketball player, I have to find a place that works around my schedule. How hard has this decision been for you? In some cases, it's been extremely difficult, and in others, it's only been very difficult. When did you know? This morning, on my way to class, you know, kind of just hit me. I, I knew what was going to be right. Who all knows of the decision that you're about to make? Everybody. Everybody knows? Yes. Dr. Brown knows? Um, actually, I just got off the phone with him. Pastor Rome? Um, he was the first to know. Carl Ruby? I'm not sure who that is. He's the vice president of student life, says hi to everyone. Sometimes he pulls out the turtleneck. Oh, yes, yes. Um, he knows as well. Who doesn't know? Uh, just you. I'm the only one on campus who doesn't know. Yes, that's right. Will I be the last to know? Not necessarily. I, I may not tell you. All right, Brian. I think we've waited long enough. What is your decision? Today for lunch, I'm, I'm going to be taking my hunger to the lower SSC to eat in the hive. You're choosing to dine in the hive? Yes, that's correct. How do you think this decision will affect your relationship with the staff at Chuck's? I hope it won't affect it too much, you know. It's been a long run, and I'm, I'm hoping they'll understand. Just a second. Brian, we're getting a live feed now from Chuck's. If we just want to look at our monitors, we can see Chuck's reaction. He is not happy. Come on, Brian! That, that is not good. That, Brian... Brian, how does seeing this, how does that make you feel? Um, it just makes me sad, you know. I'm, I've given scan after scan to Chucks, and I'm a little disappointed that they feel like I'm betraying them. All right, Brian, well, you've given us a lot of information today. Obviously, you're going to eat today for lunch in the hive. It's just a lot to digest. I think it's time for you to fulfill your decision. Thank you. Thank you, Brian. <laughs>